What up, what up, people? This lettuce here. Beat mix down. Beat mix Wednesdays. Yes, sir. That's what we got today. I'm your man, DJ Lettuce. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for chilling. Thanks for hanging. Come on through and uh, let's chat. Chat and chill. Come on, people. Let's get it. Let's chat and chill. I'm your man's lettuce. I'm your host. And today I'm doing a mix down. Yes, sir. We're getting a live mix down on a beat that's going on. That's what I'll be doing today. This one you hear right now has been made for film and TV. So we're ready to knock them down and make it a actual film and TV beat today. It will also be doing feedback, all that good stuff if y'all want it on y'all's beats. You know, we'll check them out and see what's happening. So hit your boy up. Tell a hater, tell a friend, come on through. We got these beats jumping, so let's get it. The name of this is called With The Shits. Go. And what we're doing is I'm showing you all a shot of the studio before I do a full makeover of this bad boy. <laughs> this is what it is right now. It's where we're working. It's our workspace. Trying to mix and EQ everything as we go along. One of the best things you can do is mix as you go along because once you find out that you mix when you go along, your projects are ready to go and you don't even remember. Like, teach! Already did it. Yes, sir. So, let's get it. Get it. All right, let's get this mix going. First, we're gonna check and make sure every single track had the EQ on it. Every single track except for a tag had the EQ on it. So far, 
At least this one. We need to put a filter EQ on it. Looks like it's working. So we got the filter EQ on it. We should be good. I don't see any other reasons why we shouldn't. Sounds good. It's working. We can hear the melody. We can feel it. So we should be able to get it. Let's move on. First time we're gonna mess with it, the perk loop. This right here. This is gonna be my intro, so I gotta give that something, you know. Always check my presets to see if I have one. I don't know if I even have a perk loop um, setting, but we're gonna check. They don't, so we're gonna play with it and we're gonna make it a preset. So that's, that's good because that's basically just background noise. But it's good on the intro because it's an intro. Alright, cool. Now we're going to go to the first synth lead. First synth lead is what's going to give us more depth in this track. So since we have the depth, that, that very first one, we're going to use it. We're going to use it to our advantage. Okay, so we're already... Alright, cool. Uh, here we go. It's time to EQ this. First, we're going to give it some plus four, plus five. Plus four, plus five is a uh, pretty good, a pretty darn good range for what we're doing. So we're going to keep this running in a loop so we can mix it. We want it to sound nice and full, but also very clear. So we're gonna raise it up about five, six dBs. And we wanna take some of the low end out so we don't get any uh, crackle and different things because this is a synth, but it's not a bass synth. So we can do that. We want it to sound wide and full. There we go. So that's everything for that one. Now we're gonna add the other one to show you what it sounds like. They kind of work together, and so that's what we're looking for. So, all right, let's move on forward. There's a third one now. So now that we're in here on the third one, we're gonna play with this loop. Up oh, wrong one. This one, it's time to EQ it. like that all right so these are some uh, pads this is our lead pad so let's go to my pads I have one I got two different kinds I think I like that one better I do presets because I've already done them so I run into my presets and EQ them at these levels and just turn them down just a tiny bit now I want to make sure it fits the track, so I want to start it and let it ride from the beginning. 
and we're gonna play that uh, other instrument that I have muted. Oops. <laughs> control S, people. Yes, Control S. Control S is your friend. Believe that. There we go. All right. Sounds good. We got another one in. Now we got all of it, man. It's built. Actually, we gotta do this. <laughs> we gotta get all these to back out there. If I'm gonna use them. But we're working on it, just to see. But we're not, probably not gonna work on it. Though. So on the EQ and the mixing of the beat, this is where we're at right now. Let's see what we can do about that right quick. Of course, we know it sounds repetitive, but that's what we have to do as producers to make sure every element is correct. So. Right now we're moving on to the hats. We're getting ready to EQ the hats in the track. Um, it's a must to EQ the hat. There's nothing I can say about it, but you have to EQ the hat. You have to EQ everything. We want everything as clear as possible. And as you can see, I got presets already ready for my hat. And that's fine. I, I do hats very well. <laughs> Dope. Real dope. I like that. I think we'll do that. That might be a different. Yeah, that was a big difference. I end up handing the hat. This just makes that sound really better. It's dope. Cool. Don't even matter. It's perfect for what we did. Yeah, we want to get rid of low air, much low air as possible. You know? We really don't need any bass in the hat. You know? There it is. That should be perfect. Yes, sir. Get the strap. All right. So far, everything sounds good. Let's drop this bass. We're getting ready to play with the bass. As soon as the bass comes in, we're going to play with it. So we have an intro. We got to do the, the rise, too. So let's play with the rise. It's 
it's actually called a transition, so we can use it. Either way, it still works for us. This There we go. Let's see. Let's see how this works out. <laughs> we already got Maximus and an EP. Oh, we good. That might be our key right there for the bass subs, and I think we—I think all this is going to be perfect for what we're looking for. Here it comes. I cut 200 on my low frequencies. Anything below 200, I cut it, and anything before below 2,000 on my highs, I cut that too. We do about 2,500, so you know, almost uh, 3,000. And my low cut, I want it to be as smooth as possible, so sometimes I, I raise that because I want it to be what it is. Even a low cut of nine hertz is dope. The name of this is called With the Shit. Let's get it next one. Okay. Hat, scratch, and transition. Symbol, something like that is what's going to be. So it's going to be these two. Um, over here on the EQ, I'm already preset because that's just how I work. <laughs> So we're gonna hit this symbol preset. If I go in the transition, it's gonna be the same setting. So depending on which one I use. There's a fast transition. And then there's a hip hop transition. What's a hip hop transition? Because uh, it has less bass. The lows are mostly taken out and it's really crisp and clear for the transition. Purpose of that one. See? See? Let's see what we can do. We might not even use it. Now, here's the crash. I got presets. I go into my presets and I find my letters crashes because it's already set. I ain't got to worry about none. See that? That's dope. Tune them down a little bit to make it work. Yes, sir.
I recall that sound of the snare. Um, the first time I heard it was in uh, Chain Music by Wale. Now time to add these kicks. Sizzle, sizzle snare. One of those. This is the 21 and up. So don't complain about my words. You came to my channel. I love y'all. But this is mine. <laughs> Just keeping it real. Alright, let's let this rock. Now we're going to add the drums and see what they do. Hey, hey, Pastor Purple, how you doing? I didn't see you there. <laughs> I'm just trying a little screen to see what it looks like. How's the video look? How's the audio look? How's the studio uh, cam look? Does that look okay? Is it decent? Is the audio good? No problem, no problem. I'm just checking it out, seeing what it sounds like. Does it look good? Is I guess it's my question. Does the, the video look good? Is the studio set up? Can you see that? Is it clear to see? And, you know, that's what I'm looking for. Not a problem, not a problem. This one's ready now. We're gonna let the whole beat ride right now. The whole beat gonna ride from beginning to end. We're gonna check out all of the sounds and see what they got going for themselves right now.
man, that shit hard right there. Oh my goodness. I am tripping. Lock these snares down. Drop these drums.
So the problem here is I got this really let's see if this works. <laughs> Listen to that heat. Sounds like I got hats competing, so I gotta change that real quick. So let's get it. Watch this breakdown, this shit's hard.
All right, I'm gonna make the stinger right now. What I'm gonna do is take all this. I'm gonna shift it over because I don't need it at all. And then I'm going. Oops, I'm going to mute everything over here. I don't need any of them. And what wasn't muted, I'm going to delete because it was already muted. <laughs> And now I'm gonna put the riser in there. And we're going to move this over to the end to be part of the stinger. <laughs> Now I need to go find a bell. <laughs> this was my problem. I could not find a bucket. I had so many folders open. Where'd all my folders go? Uh, I guess I lost them all. That sucks. I found some, some bells. I'm going to use this riser. That's a uh, hell of a... I found some in another space. I was going through these things too. I found some samples from the fact. Yes, those. See if I can go find those bells. Because now I need those bells.
about the sound of that. Listen to that. All right, now see everything's mixed and ready to go now. Letting it ride. We want to make sure everything's crisp and clear because of the mix. Mix is so clear and crisp that it's, it's awesome. I'm liking how it sounds, and it's really giving me depth on the bass. While I'm here, I'm also mixing in headphones, so I'm not just using my monitors, my studio monitor and sub, you know, um, but it's, I'm actually mixing it. I kind of like to hear it first before I start mixing on the, the loudspeakers, so I know what I'm getting into on my headphones, that's all. Now I need a bell and maybe a brass. I think there's already a brass on that one. Trying to find some bells, that's all.
I'm looking for a hat or uh, a bell right now. Hey, simply Lisa. What up? What up? How's it, the look? Look. <laughs> I guess. How does it look? Does it look all right? I'm trying to find some some uh, something. I don't know what it is. I don't know where I'm looking, but I'm trying to find. Let's try this one. See what that does. Oops. Let's see if I can move that one up. Let's see what it do. How you doing today? Another film and TV beat. That's what this is. That's what you hear. Right, this ride from the beginning. This is the next one. It's a flat.
I know, I be tripping. I like that sound. I like that sound too. <laughs> there go a clap. There's a clap to hold the space for right now. It's just a placeholder. You know I ain't gonna use it, but it's just a, a, a placeholder. Like I always say. I throw it in there now because I'll use it later. Or I use it now, you know. When I, <laughs> yeah, I heard a space over here. I think.
All right, that's a good mix. We're going to let this ride. Let's see what it sounds like from beginning to end. No pauses, no stops. Let's ride. Final mix. <laughs> Thank all of y'all for tuning in with me. I appreciate y'all. I'm out. This is just for y'all to see some mixing in process so y'all can understand it. But there it is, y'all. Have a great day. Have a great evening. Peace.